I were in West Irvine, which is just on the west side of the toll road, in between the toll road and Jamboree. And this is 76 Congress Place. Uh, it's a detached condo, listed at 479 900, three bedrooms, two and a half baths, 1425 interior. Um, regular sale. You have a little parquet, reminiscent of the Boston Garden uh, entry, and then you've got a little living area this way to the right with ceiling fan, and then the windows are dual vinyl, which is nice. A little bit of odor. It sounds, it smells like they had pets, and maybe they just did the shampoo. So. And when you have pets, and then you shampoo your carpet, and then you close the windows, it can stink a, a little bit. Um, but one thing you do is replace the carpet pretty easily. And then this, I think this is like the dining area. Um, you have relatively smaller downstairs. Uh, half bathroom. That's kind of neat. Not really. That looks like it's antique, but it looks like it's just kind of been destroyed. Um, maybe a new vanity at some point. It's supposed to look old and antique. I guess it definitely does. It's almost like a, a wood countertop, or you know, maybe brass fixture. Uh, wallpaper, uh, and then you have the kitchen. So the kitchen is pretty bright. Um, linoleum, refrigerators here. And then this is the exterior. So you have flagstone. Um, and then that wall is the neighbor's uh, is the neighbor's house. So you're detached, and you have a little access point. AC's right there. Access point to the garages. Like I have there's got direct TV. That's cool. Um, and then this is just like a little walkway to the neighbor's front door. So you'll see this floor plan basically everywhere. North Park. West Irvine, Quail Hill, or Oak Creek, uh, Turtle Ridge. Pantry. And then two car garage, washer and dryer right in here. Good. That all looks fine. There is a leak right here. You have to like check into that. Um, I would probably just cut that open and see what's going on. Um, I think a lot of people will paint this. You can see it's all been taped. Upstairs. The carpet looks fine, it's just a little smell. And then the paint place is yellow, so I think I'd probably just put a new carpet and paint repaint. Uh, top of the stairs you have the hall bathroom. Pretty basic. Nice part about detached places is you get sunlight from all four sides, which is pretty big. Uh, this bedroom is probably 12 by 12, so good size. And then you've got the uh, mirror closet. 
This other one was probably about the same, 12 by 12. And then master, I'd say 14, 13 by 13, 14 by 14. And then the location of this property in, in reference to the streets, uh, having the street come directly at you, uh, a lot of people will think that that is bad feng shui. Um, but there's a lot of people who don't care. So, something to think about. Um, Let's just back up, check this out. Master bath. I do get comments that people wish that, um, oh man, they wish that the master had a door and it looks like these guys try to achieve that. I'd probably just take that down. And there's a little lock, it's a little bit strange. Uh, carpet. At least you have linoleum in the, in the bath. Um, in the tub area, big tub. And then I like the windows right here. Nice bright bathroom. Um, and then you also have a walk-in closet. So it's a cool setup. Downstairs is, you know, it's kind of compartmentalized with the living area, the dining, and the kitchen, uh, depending on what you like. And I'd say new carpet, uh, maybe repaint, and then maybe a new vanity downstairs. Uh, everything else looks fine. That's Congress. And I think the leak probably came from over here in this bathroom somehow. Maybe the toilet overran or something. Anyway, Congress, 76.